How's it going guys? Prompt Films and today we're going to be reacting to episode 3 of Marvel's Echo. This episode is titled Tuck Low. But yeah, last episode not a lot really happened other than, you know, Maya infiltrated a train, put a device into a container, and then it blew up in New York once it got into the warehouse. Now obviously Fisk's men are going to be looking for Maya. We also had Maya's grandmother find out that Maya's in town, and then we also have Maya's leg got damaged while she was on the train, so her grandfather had to make a new one, well, a temporary new one. And then she also got help from Biscuits to get onto the train, which was kind of funny, but yeah, not a lot really happened. It was just kind of a filler episode, kind of, like, <laughs> okay, we blew up a container. What's that going to do for us? Because at the end of the day, isn't she bringing more danger to her family right now? Because they're so close to her. So, like, if Fisk finds out where she is, her family's going to be in danger. But, yeah, like I said, not a lot really happened, to be honest. So, I guess we should just stop doolallying around with this shitty intro and get right into the fucking episode. I still feel like a recap for a binge show is kind of stupid, but whatever. <laughs> also, what? <laughs> the White Horseman. I find this interesting. <laughs> like, well, bang. Oh. Silent film. Tuckler. That's who we saw, right? Hey, the camera quality is too good for this time. <laughs> They're doing silent film, but it's not accurate. Like, come on, it wouldn't look that good. To give life means nothing if I cannot protect her. I don't get why they're doing it like this, though. <laughs> it's weird. Why not just have it be how the other flashbacks were? They will see me as I am. No! Oh, a trap! It's a trap! The movie would be over by now, like, stop it. <laughs> oh, yeah. What? See what I mean? They could have just done it in black and white. Why did they do the silent film shit? I don't know, I, I, I mean, that was a cool intro, but it, I, I, it's just weird. Why, why do the... Silent film. I feel like it would have worked much better if you actually got the dialogue and stuff rather than reading it. I guess sound returned to the world once she got her powers. <laughs> Imagine the whole episode was like a silent film. <laughs> What's he doing? It's me, Chuck Ma. I'm just fine. Cut the crap. I didn't come here to get laid up by some old rest dog like him. <sighs> My is back. Thought that might have something to do with it. I mean, he knows. Go sit over there. <laughs> She's bringing trouble with her. And now Biscuits is caught up in it. She's too much like her father. You don't know that. You don't even know her. And you do? Yeah. yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> What's she up to then? Why don't you ask her? Not likely. Everything I've done has been to protect my family. Why don't you just swallow your pride before you lose your granddaughter too? I can't talk to her. It was not her fault. Well, maybe you shouldn't talk to her. Maybe you should just listen for once. Yeah, like, you can't really be pissed at Maya. Like, the father, sure, but... Like, it's not her fault. Night, have a ready wait for my call. This motherfucker did. Also, was he an agent of S.H.I.E.L.D.? What the fuck? Yeah, that's not creepy at all. What the fuck? Her ancestors just got her captured. <laughs> Hang it upside down. Why wouldn't they take the leg off? You see what I mean? <laughs> I think she easily escaped that. Who the fuck? Oh shit, they've got him too. <laughs> Why would you? That's stupid. There's obviously something in there that she can use to escape. That Bonnie. 
Hello? Mm. Shut up, shut up. Of course, you know, she's gonna find another way in. <laughs> Uncle Henry? Was that the mystery box noise? From God? <laughs> hey, Jesus fucking Christ. Hey, I, tried I just have some questions I wanna ask you. Uh, privately. It's doing sign language. I'll leave you to it. Appreciate it. All right, Bonnie. Huh? Did you know she was coming around? Uh-uh. More people coming around here? Go. I mean, family's gonna pay social calls. Like, what do you want? Dispatch. Dispatch. Jesus fucking Christ. What is with the job scares? Also, who got it? Oh, Bonnie oh, is gonna see Maya. Yep. Hey, what's up? I mean, like, she's got, like, a blade in it, yeah. That was easy. <laughs> hey, wait a minute, the leg isn't squeaking anymore. The fuck? Continuity? I mean, can you blame her? She was going through some shit. Probably would have been better if she went with Bonnie versus with Fisk. Tell her it was a misunderstanding. That way, if you leave now, you got nothing to worry about. What did you do? <laughs> no, Maya brought this on herself coming home. All I did was accelerate the process. You really think he's going to pay you and then just let you walk out of here? No, that's not how Fisk does things. Oh. No audio, which means fight scene. Why did she slap the phone out of his hand? Come on. <laughs> Who the fuck is Grace? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> well, if you need her alive, stop pointing guns. The foot is literally an empty threat. They're here. Okay. Who the fuck are these two women? <laughs> oh, it says fuck. You're the guy then. Yeah, I'm the guy. For your sake, I hope the information you've been texting is legit. Guaranteed, it's the real deal. Vicky's dead. So when you brought that money, I uh. Yeah, he needs to see. Safe while I assess the situation. You work, yeah? Yeah. You're somewhere. Now, I was thinking you show me that money first and make sure it's all there. Like I need to know that you have it. What did you expect? I mean, they'll probably just kill you after this is all done anyway. How the fuck? How'd she do that? <laughs> it's gonna bounce off it. Hmm. Why would she go in? Is she dumb? Well, yeah. <laughs> it's like the fucking Ark and Reddit. Is she stupid? I thought that would have killed it. <laughs> Supposed to be making a deal, not giving them the grand tour. Can you let me handle this? What's up, kitty cat? <laughs> Where's that niece of yours, huh? We're actually not at liberty to say until we get our money. <laughs> so tired of all this yapping. Hey, hey, hey don't be, none of that yapping. <laughs> I'm gonna go check on something. Matter of fact, she probably needs a hand with that, so I'm gonna head out and I'll be right. Was something wrong? To catch that, brothers? Vicky, you're dead as fuck, dude. Vicky wants to go out. You fucking dumbass. Oh! Oh! Jesus! Thanks again. Would have been nice if she were, you know, here. I mean, what did he expect? I got her I want here. You's the one who's gonna give me the answers to my question. Yep. <laughs> what? What's this song been used in before, like... I feel like it's been used in a fight scene. <laughs> this is copy by... Uh, uh, I. Oh. Oh. Yep. Oh! Like in the little cuts there. He's dead. <laughs> oh! 
A suplex? Why did they cut that? They could have had it be like a one shot, like a game, you know? Then they kind of did that in John Work, right? You know how hard it is to pull them out? What the fuck? Indiana Jones? Can they just shoot the uncle now, though? And then threaten Bonnie? <laughs> then she'd stop. <laughs> a fucking hole. Well, that went well. Now I assume they're gonna take her to New York? Uncle's dead, yeah. The king is awake. Or some shit. I understand, but I'm sorry, I... You guys are lucky. I assume it was like, Kingpin's alive, he's awake, head back to New York. Does Maya know? I mean, probably for her. I love how she said uh, she won't let anyone hurt her, but she's hurt her the most. <laughs> Which part? The part where we almost die. Maybe there's not a price on her head anymore because Kingpin's alive. Only one person who could have. It only took shit to hit the fan for that to happen, though. <laughs> it's got the new leg. What the fuck? You represent your people. If you uh, don't uh, like it, I'll take it back. I could <laughs> uh, paint it matte black. It's fucked up. Can't hide his uh, masterpiece. I don't get in uh, family business. You uh, won't go see her. No. Her heart was broken when you left. I guess we all do things we wish we didn't. We're different. Did you go and back to New York? Jesus fucking I did. Why'd she hit her there? It looked like she was looking at the camera then. Wait, is she? What the fuck? It looked like she was looking at the camera. No, she's back home. What's gonna happen now? Oh. Is that Kingpin? What the fuck? Why is he just there? Also, what? Is he, is he stupid? What's stopping Maya from just shooting him again? <laughs> How did he survive? Where did she hit him? I mean, the eye, I guess? What the fuck? Did it skim the eye? But I'd probably say that might be the best episode so far. Just a lot happened. You know, we had the skate rink stuff. We had... Kingpin show back up, we had Maya learn about Kingpin still being alive, and we obviously had the reunion between Bonnie and Maya, and the fight scene. So, it was like, everything that happened in this episode was decent, you know? I'm not really complaining, other than, like, certain aspects of it being a little bit slow, but, you know, we got a cool fight scene, we got some big story stuff happening, you know, Kingpin's back, he's there, <laughs> waiting for Maya. I didn't expect him to just show up like that, like, we saw him at the end of episode one, still in the hospital bed, and now he's <laughs> at the house. But yeah, I'm still trying to question how Kingpin's alive, right? <laughs> like, his eye's obviously gonna have to heal, because it would be weird from now on that he's just got an eye patch in the MCU, but it could be a cool look, I guess, right? I hope we actually get to see from his perspective, whether, like, next episode or in Daredevil, Born Again, like, we actually get to see, like, how he survived and what happened to him there. I do find it weird how Marvel and Disney kind of marketed this show heavily with the TVMA stuff. Because so far, there hasn't been a lot of violence. There's been a bit of it, and there's been more, like, blood shown compared to other Marvel stuff, but it's still not 
like, holy shit. Like, did they really need to market it that heavy with the TVMA shit? Unless episode 4 and 5 go fucking insane with the brutal shit. I doubt it, though. But yeah, I am definitely curious to see what happens with uh, Fisk being back now. Like, are they just going to be talking? Is Mai going to try and kill him again? Is he going to capture her? Kidnap her? Take her back to New York or something like that? I don't know. But yeah, I'm glad Disney and Marvel decided to release this all at once, because... Like, if it was a weekly release, my god, it'd be terrible. Because, <laughs> like, so far, like, we've had episode one, which has basically just been a recap of uh, Hawkeye. Episode two, which not a lot happened. And then this episode, a lot happened. But then, like, the bigger stuff is coming next episode with Kingpin and Maya meeting, right? So, it's kind of just like... Well, imagine we had to wait four weeks to get that interaction again. <laughs> Yeah, like I said, probably the best episode so far, which doesn't really say much because it's only been three episodes, but hopefully they keep that momentum going in to the next two. Because we know what Disney is like and Marvel is like. Usually they go downhill towards the end. But sometimes it's like the show starts out really good and then it flops. But so far, like, the show started out okay and... Hopefully it's got a really good ending. We'll see. I mean, two episodes left. I don't know. Yeah, that basically sums it all up. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And I will see you for the next one. Ta-ta and fair.